Yer, what up? Welcome back to the video, guys. We got a nice little installation for you guys today. Yeah, we got two new Clockworks windshield for the bike. Now we got two flavors for you. We got an orange. This one's gonna come in a six inch. I really like the orange. It's really, really nice. I wanted a color kind of to make it pop from those days when it was like super sunny. I'm staying local and I just wanna look good, stand out. I got the orange for that. Yeah, everything's just dropping out of the sky. We also got an eight inch. This one is gonna be in a bronze shade right here. Really, really nice. Eight inch, much taller, is gonna give you much more wind protection. Especially for those longer rides, this is the one that I'm most likely gonna be using the most. Um, I love the flare on both windshields. It just it just gives a little pizzazz, a little just makes it a little bit more special. But anyways, what we're gonna do for you right now is gonna I'm gonna install both of them out for you, give you a quick little look of what they both are gonna look like on the bike, and then we're gonna take it on the road. I'm really eager to test this one out because I wanna compare it to the stock windshield that's on there right now. I know the six inch orange windshield is gonna be an improvement over the stock, but this is the main one that I wanna try. And I also know that this is the main one that you guys are gonna ask questions for. So uh, yeah, let's put these things on and let's take it on the road. But just to give you a nice little reference, this is the orange one placed over the stock windshield, which is basically the same height. This one just has a flare to it, so is it gonna help with wind? Yes, it is. We'll go ahead and we'll just mock it on here for you guys real quick, just to kind of give you a look of what it's gonna, what's it gonna look like. what the orange one will look like on it now pretty sure in a few weeks I'll take it off I'll switch them out and I'll rock out with this one for a little bit um, but I'm really eager to try out the 8 inch now one thing you should know is that these rubber grommets were on the original stock windshield you're gonna have to take those off and put them on the new one So first things first, what do you guys think about the look in the cockpit now? Do you like it from your uh, perspective, from your view, or do you not? I wanted to get some like around town speeds first and then hop on the uh, highway and test it out on there as well. So right off the bat right now we're hitting 43 right now, local roads, I could tell a huge difference already. Um, Around this speed limit, 45, 50, I was kind of getting a lot of wind against my helmet before. Um, but this took all that off right now. It's awesome. Um, as far as wind against here, I feel like there's like a big bubble. Let me see. Yeah, kind of just like whoop, kind of floats everything right over my helmet. <laughs> Um, there's like a big bubble right here in front of me. Obviously, we're gonna get some wind on the side of your arms But a big difference big big difference so 8 inch for sure guys if you want to look at the 8 inch You want to knock a lot of wind off of you This is the one to go with I think they do have taller ones, but I mean, I don't know if anyone wants to go taller than that I mean you could you could if you want to get like a big clear windshield in case you have a long trip planned ahead and not have you know any fatigueness on those long trips that's what those big shields are for guys i mean i know sometimes the big big ones don't look as nice but they serve a purpose and it's 
to not be so fatigued on those long rides. Because that wind will beat you up. What do you guys think about the bronze color? I really like it. Really, really like it. I didn't want to do like a dark smoke on this one, being that it's so tall. Um, and I thought that it was going to kind of be like in my line of view, but it's not. I'm looking right over the windshield, which is a plus. It's not interfering with anything. So if that was going to be your next question, there you go. I answered it for you. Um, now, again, let me just remind you, I'm around 5'7". So taller riders, for sure, for sure, taller riders are going to want to get a, an 8 inch or above. If you're six feet and above, I would even consider even a taller one than a than an eight inch. I gotta check to see what the next one is. Is it is it a nine? Is it a ten? I'll post it right here. All right, so we're gonna go ahead up in the highway, give you guys that uh that first take. I'm actually gonna head over to. My guy Rich's house right now, Baggers and BS. Gonna go out for a little ride. It's a beautiful day out here in dirty Jersey. Blue skies, clear skies. High of 45 to 50 degrees today, so not too shabby. Okay, so. Yeah, huge difference, huge, huge difference. Hitting 81 right now, and huge difference, man. I don't feel that crazy buffering that I was feeling before right on my helmet, literally on my face. Now it's just literally going above, right over my helmet. This is awesome. Blockworks windshield for the win. Now I do gotta say, I actually do like the look of the stock shield that the bike comes with. I think it's a great design by Harley Davidson. Like it, it looks really cool. It looks like something you would buy aftermarket. I really like it. But I do want more wind protection for sure. And I love the flare design on the Clockworks windshield here. Super cool. I'm happy with this. Let me uh, just get over to Rich's house real quick and get his take on it so you guys can hear what he thinks. Crazy, right? Sunlight makes it sick. Bro. Crazy, right? Holy cow. Like, you pull it up, it's just... I don't know, man. I knew it. I was just waiting for that. That cloudy day did not do it justice. And I'm telling you right now, bro, looking at it with the sun hitting it... It's crazy, right? Yeah, yeah. I have, I have a confession to make, bro. What? I've been talking to Billy about getting one of these. <laughs> That you want to get one of these? I've been talking to him about it, but I don't think it's going to happen. I don't think it's going to happen. I'll let you take it out for a ride one of these days, man. Uh, absolutely, man. Look, I just put this Clockworks windshield. This is an 8-inch. Oh. Bronze I, color. I knew something was different. I'm telling yeah. you. Yeah. Well, the Bajas. The Baja, I knew. They look fantastic. That I saw immediately. Yeah. I saw your video. Yeah. On top of that, I, I just... I'm looking as you're riding it, I'm like, what looks different? What looks different? Did you make a video on this? Uh, I'm literally right now. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> right now. Nice work, nice work, oh, thanks, man. Look. Psh, torque. <laughs> but yeah, I'm looking. I'm like, what is going on here? That's what it is. The wind is built. And that offers the proper wind protection. Oh, yeah. It's much taller. So the, the, the original one was like five or six-ish. Right. You know, this was an eight inch. It was a bronze color. Flare. I mean, it's Sick, right? So, guys, listen. This guy has three baggers, and he wants a little rider ST. That's it. What else can you even say after that? What you guys think about the Clockworks windshield, the Baja new setup that we got on here, looking, looking super, super clean. Drop your thoughts down below. Let me know if you like the bronze color, if you like the orange one, or if you just like the stock one. But this is the look right now. That's it. Drop your thoughts in your comments down below. I'm going to catch you guys in the next one. Like always, let the force be with you. Ride safe and enjoy the ride, baby. Peace. Oh, peace.